Good morning, and uh, today I'm talking about a new app that I found called Rover. For anybody who is developing e-learning content, you know that you know we all want our e-learning content to be accessible on as many devices as possible, and certainly the iPad is one of those devices that we want our content to be available to iPad users. And uh, you know, I've been looking around for ways to make the content I build. I use a tool called Articulate and you can visit Articulate at Articulate.com. We're going to show you that website here in a little bit. And uh, when you build Articulate uh, content, you output or publish to a Flash file. And, of course, that's not playable on an iPad. Even if you have it embedded in an LMS, which we'll visit an LMS here in a little bit, um, still, no luck, can't play it on the iPad. So I was really excited to hear about Rover late last night. This morning, got up, downloaded it within minutes. I'm really convinced it works very, very well. Essentially, Rover is a browser that uh, you access a site. The site goes through Rover's um, streaming service and then streams it back out to your browser. So you should expect that there's a little bit of delay in accessing the content, but you'll see here, not too bad. They do recommend that you use a Wi-Fi connection, not a 3G or 4G connection. Well, actually, they said 3G. I just sort of threw in the 4G there. Um, so uh, here you can see that I'm on Google.com, so it works just like a browser. You know, type in up here, Google.com, go to Google.com, and then uh, you have tabbed environments. So here is uh, Articulate.com, and I am looking at the presenter area, and you can scroll. And um, one of the samples here, we're just going to click on it, and let's view this one. You can see that the flash content loads. You can hear the audio. And I can use all of the functions. These are all buttons. A great way to protect your identity is to look for suspicious activities. It's all about use all the functions within the actual player controls. So you can see that uh, it works quite well. So I can navigate around. Again, the audio kicks off. Press pause. All right, so all the functionality, the speed is pretty good. The uh, graphics are really fairly clear. Occasionally, as you can, I don't know if you can see it on the video, you can see these little lines here. I have noticed that sometimes graphics get interpreted with, uh, and you can see sort of an outline. So I'm guessing whoever developed this, maybe there's some graphics in the background here that have a little bit of an outline, and you'll see that here on some of the content I've built too. But I don't think it's distracting considering that uh, sometimes it happens, sometimes it's not, it doesn't. So it depends maybe on the streaming uh, connectivity. So I'm going to actually take you out to my course that I'm building now with one of my partners. This is an LMS, this is the Acuity LMS, and again, this content, normally on an iPad, this is not even visible at all because this is Flash. I'm actually going to make this pop out to full screen so that we can see it. And again, this is coming directly from an LMS through Rover, so the connection speed, I think, is actually pretty good. And we have full control, this is all built in Flash. Again, I'm on the iPad using Rover. And I can use the buttons that we've built down below. This is back and next and a home if you can't quite see it. So green and yellow and the home button in the middle. And I have no problem accessing the content using all of these controls at the bottom. And you can tell over here in the menu that I'm going down through the menu items. All right, so I can scroll up. Uh, let's see, so creating jobs. This is a topic that we're covering in the course. I can again go through no problems. Here's an interactive, so in creating jobs, I'm just going to show this one. And a little interaction. Let's see, I want to learn a little bit more about contractors. So contractors opens, and there's some text about contractors. I can close that. And I can go to another one. Maybe I want to learn about vendors. Let's read about vendors. I can read a little bit about vendors. So um, I think it works really, really well. You know, the touch screen um, controls are accurate. I think the speed is actually pretty good, and as you can tell, we can go to uh, any web page. We could go to a web page with embedded Flash, and we can even go to something as complex as an LMS, which uh, controlled uh, logins are accessible, and it didn't have any issues here. Uh, accessing the content shows up fine. And I think the speed and quality is actually quite good. So check it out, Rover, on the Apple Store. Download it, it's free, and you will then be able to access Flash content. So enjoy.